Right, so this is going to be a One Piece theory about Raft, though, the final island in One Piece. And basically, I'm not really going to focus too much on the island Raft, except that I'm going to say that a lot of One Piece theories have said that Raft is an invisible island that will reveal itself once some conditions are met to the people, the pirates are trying to get there. So that's all I'm really going to say about Raftal and that's an island. Another thing I'm going to say is that Raftal is an island, which means it could be a big island or a small island. And this is where my theory comes in. So if Raftal, I see Raftal as a big island that's invisible. And this is how I perceive the ending of One Piece. Well, there were maybe a one episode after this, but towards the ending of One Piece, basically, it's the same thing. Um, when Luffy and his crew, the Straw Hats, arrive on Raftal, they, when they get there, they won't be the first ones that landed on the island. When, all the, when the pirates get there, like, those who get there before them, the treasure of Gold Roger is going to still be hidden on the island, so they probably got to um, solve some some patterns or something like that some puzzles just to get to the treasure and and the island itself and when they get to the shore maybe they see blackbeard this is what this is what i think as they're looking for the treasure blackbeard's crew is there because blackbeard of course he's everybody's saying he's the final villain and stuff which i have no problem with that blackbeard versus luffy because Blackbeard was the one that defeated Ace and gave him up to the Marines, which was really messed up. And that's why Ace kind of died in early death in the series. So we could get Blackbeard versus Luffy in Raft, though, for the One Piece, basically. Like, they're fighting for the One Piece. And basically, Luffy has to knock him out or something. So he could get to the One Piece first and actually declare that he is the Pirate King. Because... Blackbeard has the same dream, but this is where the big island That I mentioned earlier like Rafto being a big island if it's a really big island that means I'm always thinking that Akainu has to fight Luffy of, of course because he killed his brother and because Akainu is that type of person that is not gonna let Luffy roam free all the time because he did not finish the job he tried to kill Luffy as well, but Luffy escaped. So that probably made Akainu angry throughout all these years, just thinking about, oh, when I when I see this straw hat kid again, I will kill him. I am a Marine. I'm justice, and he's evil. That's his mindset. That's Akainu's mindset, basically. And he will do anything to kill Luffy. So he'll be on the other side of the island, Blackbeard and Luffy on this side with his crew. And then it will be a major battle royale with, between Blackbeard's crew and Luffy's crew. And that will be really epic battles. And of course that could take up a lot of chapters. Because this is the final arc. I perceive it as this. That's going to take a lot of chapters. And the good thing about the island being big is that to get to the, where, the side where Luffy and the others are. It will take probably days or something like that, which would be really interesting. And, of course, Akainu will know that Luffy will be on the island because Luffy does want to become the Pirate King. Akainu is just there to finish the job, to deal the death blow on Luffy. So that's where the final battle comes in. So after Luffy defeats Blackbeard, not easily, the Straw Hats will take a couple of days of breaks. And then, as they're nearing the treasure, like they're getting nearer, nearer to it, their paths will interlock with Akainu's. Like, they will be walking like this, and then they'll meet the Marines head on. Then you see their paths just will connect. And then Luffy will see Akainu get really mad. And that's where the final battle begins. Luffy, Luffy, Luffy on this side versus Akainu. Not for the One Piece, but for... On Luffy's ends for revenge and on Akainu's end because he left his job unfinished. This is how I see the ending of One Piece. And after this, of course, Luffy is supposed to be the Pirate King. So he will defeat Akainu some way, somehow. And basically get, gain the treasure and become the King of the Pirates. So I hope you enjoyed this video on how One Piece will end. And if you did, remember to rate, comment, subscribe to my channel, girl. And have a great day. Peace.